Hello, welcome to our channel, Okie Travelers. I'm Tracy. And I'm Melissa. We visited Greenleaf State Park in October of 2021 and had a great time. So let us share our adventure with you. Come on the journey with us. Here at Greenleaf State Park, they got a kids pond, fishing pond for you. 16 kids, I mean 16 age and younger can fish here. Three limits, three fish limit. Got this nice little photo op set up here for your kids or grandkids. We got a kids water park or kids splash pad. And then they got tent, RV camping, and then they got port, I mean some cabins. And they also have one cabin on the lake for also for disability. So far, my first impressions of Greenleaf State Park. This is a pretty nice park. Uh, everything is set up pretty well. The park office gift shop is real nice. And so far, the entrance and everything else is real nice. It's well kept up. One more over that away. And then they got the marina, Greenleaf Marina and Grill.
moving too fast probably. I got some beautiful views. Hills with trees on it. Just take a look. They mark so pretty, I think. Good morning here from Greenleaf. Here's the cricket for the frogs chirping. I mean, it's a beautiful morning. There's somebody out kayaking. They do have kayaks here. They also have boat rentals. They have bike rentals. Um, there ain't no cell service or data, so or it's limited, very limited. So if you're coming out here to camp and you think you're gonna need cell service, but you probably need to look at something else, but. This is a beautiful part. Let's take a look at the lake at the sunrise. This view is behind the Discovery Center. I think it's more like their amphitheater or amph I don't know where they put on talks and shows for the kids. But look at the view here. And then the Discovery Center is right there. And then there's the chairs for the kids to sit at. I know they do activities here. Uh, Thursday night, they did, they brought their big telescope out so they can watch the, for the kids, watch the meteor shower that was going on. So they do have activities for the kids, like tonight is hayride and s'mores. This park does a lot of activities. There's a deer over there behind that picnic table. Hope you see it. Look like a deer up there by that red truck too. Out this early morning walk. There's the cabins. Some of the cabins. And up here in the morning, or now, there's deer all over the place up here by the cabins. See if it's been in the trees, but they was out in the people's lawns a while ago. Look at the rock work. This is a cabin seven. This is different cabin, different rock structure and stuff. It's still rock cabin. There's probably about six of these kind of cabins here. And in the morning, you hear a lot of movement in the in the woods around here. There goes a squirrel. In the fall, it's a good time if you want to come and see. Some wildlife, deer and stuff. Especially in the cabin areas. Or well, me walking this morning in the cabin areas, there's deer. 
plenty of deer. I don't know if you can see them, but there's turkeys in this over there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can hear them making noises walking on the grass from the leaves. There's a turkey over there. There's one up there. And there's one moving back there. One there. And some over there. I think this morning has been a productive morning with the turkeys. I don't know if you can pick them up on this video. But I've seen deer, I've seen turkeys, squirrels. This has been a pretty good morning. Here on the family trail. I think this is part of the old warehouse that they talked about in that one scene. Gas pumps. And then there's a cement dilly right there with the boat for gas pumps, looks like. I don't know, this is on that family hiking trail. And it's associated with this gas pump. And that's still part of that warehouse right through there. See them rocks? They're right there. There's another little structure. Let's see what this structure is. A loading dock. It appears to be a loading dock that used by WPA as a creation of the Greenleaf State Park. Do not harm wildlife. Each spring visitors sometimes find baby deer. Every so often they have benches to take a break if you need a break. Red cedar changes Oklahoma prairies into forests. Native plant red cedar has covered the lands that were once prairie grasslands. These red cedars look like they did. Well, bottom half, top half is not. Got rocks just bare, I mean, piled up out there. Railroads in Indian Territory. In 1909, outlaw attempt to train rob the Iron Mountain Line. There's benches, and then here's another sign. Sir John Hill, if you look to the south from the ridge, you can see the highway that climbs South Hill Ridge. See the way over there.
lucky the way you are. Arkansas River Overlook. Nachos and OU Texas game. So we just finished dinner and now we're getting together our s'more stuff. We got cinnamon graham crackers, candy corn, and then some pumpkin spice marshmallows that are shaped like pumpkins. <laughs> we are on the search of the swinging bridge here at Greenleaf Lake. Uh, we're trying to take a shortcut, but I don't know if this is going to find it or not. But I thought that wall, rock, walk wall, is somewhat pretty. This is the trail that we went to get to the bridge. This is the road that we drove down. And we made it to the bridge and we made it back. 11 minute hike, a little longer back. 
because it's a hill coming back. But, I mean, if you can find this shortcut and find this spot right here, it's a short way walk to the bridge. This is a map of the state park, and we got our parking spot at Deer Run, which is right there. And this is the campground for Deer Run. And also, we need to add that the whenever we were driving around the park, the internet at our RV site at Deer Run, you just basically don't have any internet. But up at the Gobbler Ridge area, right here, um, when we drove through there, you had a little bit better service. Did you like the Discovery Center? Seal of approval. Yep. Here at Greenleaf, uh, we collecting these passports and uh, we're gonna put the passport in our passport book. There you go, one more state park down. So we're getting ready to load up. We finished our weekend here at Greenleaf State Park. Overall, we'd say it's about a five out of 10. The things that we liked about it was the hiking trails. We liked the wildlife because you see deer and turkey. Um, we never did see Ellie the elk, which is apparently something that you can see sometimes if you get lucky. Um, they had a really cute little visitor center that was all decorated up for fall. Um, we liked the mini golf. Anything else you can think of? The things that we thought could have been better is they didn't have any kind of a playground for kids. They did have a splash pad, but we were here in October, so it wasn't open. Um, and then the lack of being able to do water sports on the lake, because my son would have brought his jet ski if they would have been able to do that. Um, but it's a beautiful place, the scenery's pretty, and we had a good weekend. So five out of 10. Yep.